We're doing an audience with me. Uh, I'm going to be painting live. Uh, and it's all to raise money for the Theatre Royal because it's been here for, oh, goodness, 200 years almost. And uh, it'd be nice to keep it going for another, another 200 years. Uh, I've been here so many times, like everybody else in Newcastle, come to Theatre Royal, and it's pure escapism. So to keep places like this alive is a must. Well, I hope a lot more people get to know the real Alexander Miller because people know him through his paintings and his gadgie. But what is the gadgie? Who is the gadgie? Why does he paint the gadgie? All those kind of questions, they're all bound up with Alex, the man. And uh, I think people are going to have their eyes open tonight about Alex. But also it's great not only to find out more about Alex, his painting, maybe to bring his painting to a wider audience, um, but also to raise funds for the theatre, and that's really important. Tonight is the first time I've actually seen the painting my way, and I just think it is phenomenal. It's Alex's gadgie in an artistic setting, which is quite unusual, and it just blows me away. It's Alex's paintings do invoke a feeling within you. Now whether that makes you cry, makes you feel down or makes you happy, this perhaps is one of the most uplifting of Alex's paintings I have ever seen. When I do audiences like this everybody always wants to know the background as you know as a setting for how the image is developed and how they were created, how they came from your subconscious to go on the canvas in the first place. So to be able to to hear me talk about uh, my early years, my formative years, and what I was like as a kid, because I was always fascinated by the minutiae of life and the small details. And so I think the audience will get like a, a, a deeper insight into everything, like a, getting a, a whole rounded out uh, view of me uh, and my work. Well, what I was doing was informing them how I became the Ganchi what I did to become the Ganji and how I met Alex and uh, what it was was I went to his studio and invited this day with my wife and I heard Alex say that he was looking for a Gachi and my wife just suddenly turned around and said you'll be a Gachi and I turned around and looked at him and he said walk up and down and that's it says, right, you can be me, Ganchi. Just like that. He's great in front of an audience, and it's probably one of his best skills. He's just brilliant in front of people, and he, has, he always has something funny to say. Um, so I thought he did really well. But when they explain at the end of the auction, I think it's a, it's a good thing to do, you know. For somebody to actually dedicate for, um, you know, for something that's local like that, it's a really good idea. Uh, uh, I mean, more people would do it, to be honest. Absolutely, absolutely great. You know, it's uh, I rely on people like Susan because they, they come out with loads of stories about their own past and their own childhood, and it's like, oh, I go away with those stories and I log them away in the, the, the bank in my head, you know, and it's just like, oh, I'll bring them, I'll bring them out and do a picture, you know. It was a fabulous evening, it really was. I, 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 he came across as such a natural person. And that's really what I enjoyed about it. It's really, really good. And he really kind of uh, connects with people, and uh, and I think that's where his strength lies. You know, because we look at things and our own memories, and that's kind of what it's all about—memories. And and that's where his strength lies. <laughs>